What'd you think about that Ramirez fight? It was a good ass fight, man. It was a real good fight. I was a fan of that. It was a, I loved it. Man. It was, it was a tough fight for both of them, um, but Ramirez pulled it out. He showed, you know, his dog, and he came out. He got the win, and I like it. I like it. Hey, Regis, he did say he'd like it to marinate a little bit. He did say he'd like you right to maybe here, fight. God, how you doing, man? You will give me the Ramirez fight, right? You're what? You're That's Regis Progray. Oh, Regis, yeah. nice to meet you, man. Good. He's interested yeah, in that I next fight. With, we talked with Lou yeah. um, uh, yesterday. Yeah. So we're going to set something up. If you talk to Lou, you got a great promoter yeah. in development. So don't worry. We're going to follow the rules. Okay, bye. You're not going to be involved going two rounds. I know. I know. Not three rounds. <laughs> I know. <laughs> what? I know. I know. Yeah, yeah, we we're talking about it a little bit. Two rounds. Terrence knocked him out in two. No, three. Three. Oh, three. I got yeah. two. <laughs> <laughs> give, me, give me my extra round. My, my extra round list. <laughs> Regis, what did you think of Ramirez tonight? He looked good. He looked good. Yeah, I mean, it was a good fight. Like, I, was, I was a fan of the night. Um, he looked real good. He, he pulled it off. He... I, I feel like he was going to win, though. You know, he got hit with a couple of shots. He looked good. So you think he was going to knock him out? Because your mom looked hurt a couple of times. He, I, thought he was, I really thought he was going to knock him out. Yeah, I, I didn't think he was going to see the final bell. I didn't, because his eye was just all bust up. I, I thought he was going to knock him out. Aram said, Aram said what he wants to do is have you maybe fight on a Ramirez card and then have you guys fight end of the year. Uh, I, don't, I don't think I want to fight on a Ramirez card. I'm, I'm already mandatory for him. But both you guys having an interim fight before facing each other, would that be okay with you? I don't know the regulations on this I one. I want to fight for the belt. You want to fight I, him I'm next? I'm already, yeah I'm, yeah. I'm supposed to be, you know, by the WBC, I'm mandated to fight the champion next. I felt like, I really felt like I was supposed to, me and Andongo should have been for a championship fight, mm -hmm. you know, um, or me and Postal, you know, mm -hmm. so. I feel like I want to fight for the belt. So that's what he said he talked about with Lou. Yeah, that's... So you'll right. talk it over with Lou yeah, and see if it what makes sense. Over, you know, yeah. person. But I want to fight. I mean, I'm a competitor. I want to fight the names. now. I'm definitely... Yeah. I want to fight the names. I, want, I still want to fight Postal. Yeah. Um, I want to fight somebody like Adrian Broner. Um, and I want to fight Ramirez, you know. But of course, before anything, I do want to get the belt. I don't want to try to, you know, swig around. And I know they, they might try to get Pacquiao to fight or something like that. I don't know, you know, but it might happen. Were you more impressed with Ramirez after what he did tonight than you were before tonight? Uh, no, because he knocked out Mike Reed in two rounds. You know, he looked he looked better when he knocked out Mike Reed. Now Mike Reed is definitely not a puncher like um, in mine, but you know he 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 stopped him pretty early. You know, so I think I was you know more impressed when he when he knocked out Mike Reed. Did you see some holes? I see a lot of holes. What holes? I think I should tell you. I mean, he got tell hit. Tell me one, just one. He got hit. He just got hit. He got hit. Uh, he got hit more. And somebody like me, I'm I'm a big big puncher and I'm a body puncher too. So, you know, I, I feel like if I hit him with some clean shots, it can possibly over. You know, but he he did get hit by mine, and mine is a big puncher too. And he withstood it. You know, I, I was here. You know, so. He got hit by some big shots and he took it, he went through them. He know, made so. a mom look like not as big a puncher. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. You know, so you know, he he does have a chin on. You know, I can I could definitely say he does have a chin. He bit down, you know, mom was hitting him with some shots. Mom was hitting him with some good body shots, a little bit of good body shots, and he bit down and you know, he came back and he beat him. Do you put Ramirez above Ndongo? You think he's a better fighting fighter than Ndongo? Um yes. Yeah, I, I think he's better than Andago. Yeah, Andago, I mean, Andago has a better resume, of course, because he had two belts. Right. But as far as style-wise, yeah, Ramirez is better than Andago. Because you I really think. impressed all of us when you took out Andago in two rounds. Yeah. You impressed all of us. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, he's best. Anago is just the, the thing with him. He's awkward. He's yeah. just an awkward fighter, and um, he's long. He's big. When I when I set up at the way is he was like this big as me. Like he was, he was big as shit. So yeah. he's just you know he's he's big. He probably intimidated a lot of people. Uh, he has a very long jab, and it's it's kind of hard to get to him. But um, as far as like better fighter, very respected. I think. Okay. When you need to I mean, I, I think I just made it. I made it easy on myself. I knew when I hit when I hit people, I'm hurt. I know that, you know. And so, I mean, I dropped. He he got up, you know. I hit him with. Like, I mean, I remember I hit him. I think the second time I dropped him, that left hand was really hard. Like I hit him. I mean, it was 
I always say like bone on bone. My my knuckle went through the glove and I felt his his skull on my knuckles. Wow. And he got up from that, you know. So I think he, you know, I think he just did as best as he can. He just I just over I overwhelmed him. What happens when you hit the nerves? Um, you know, I don't know, man. I don't know. He, you know, he, he withstood a mind shots, you know, but of course I think I can hurt him. I do think I can hurt him. Whereas, you know, we'll see. It's always it's always different from when you get in there. You can watch boxing all day long. But until you get in front of that person and they hit you and you hitting them, you never know what's gonna happen.